Back with some more freaking fish. How's it going, everyone? Welcome. Uh, we're on that $10,000 uh, grind here, and uh, really, I, I had an idea of what I should do um, kind of towards the end of the last episode, and that was more of like farming in a way. Kind of. Kind of. In a way. In a way, in a way. I don't know. I'm not really sold on my on my technique here. I probably It probably will change over time, but um, I'm going to do, again, the... the Please pick up this. Thank you. I'm going to do the um, the cost-effective way here. <clears throat> I'm going to continue with the soil. And then I like the idea. I do. I do like the idea of having singular spe species fishes. It's, uh, one species kind of a fish in the fish tank. Because um, it just makes things a lot easier, at least, when you have to plant uh, plants put plants in at least early game maybe i don't know it could be a different later game but like putting plants in um putting temperature gauges and, and keeping things like that like we found out that the xanders the xanders only like one type of well not that they only like one type but their temperature only likes one type of freshwater plant right now which okay you picky but you know maybe as things like i said progress We'll get more into it but anyways so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna kind of do the same thing i'm gonna bring in a fish and you know what this time i'm gonna experiment with saltwater fish now we have done saltwater fish briefly 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 very very briefly um it was the um i think it was the tutorial phases right we haven't done saltwater on our own so what i'm gonna do is i'm actually gonna buy salt water now salt well i can't buy salt water you have to mix the salt within the salt water i'm gonna get salt water um fish in and we'll see if this will excuse me change anything at all what i mean by that is like are we gonna get better types of deals or more expensive aquariums because they are of the kind like look this is a bermuda uh, blue angel fish this is a hundred dollar fish right that's that's a pretty big deal it's almost like the um the xander over there what if i just oh this is big too and emperor angel fish what if i were to just do emperor angel fish maybe make four four i don't know i don't know when it does when it does come down to salt water i feel like having a mixture of a little bit of this and a little bit of that is not bad especially in a big aquarium that we have now I hate that I buy the fish first. I shouldn't buy the fish first. I should buy them last. That should be the last thing I really do. Uh, let's... Oh, by the way. Good shout. Last comment. Sorry, last video. People were saying... Your your fish died. <laughs> I hate to say this out loud. Your fish died because you did not feed them. You actual idiot. Okay. Fair play. I totally forgot that you have to feed there's a feeding mechanic right i get so lost in the sauce when it comes to just like building the aquarium and here we are having to actually have to deal with feeding the fish it's a good thing it's a good thing i'm not saying it's bad it's a good thing 22 to 25 22 to 25 22 to 25 what comes up to 24 25 okay um 24 to 25 that would work honestly i i really don't think it's going to be a big problem here let's go ahead and turn this oh god Let's go ahead and turn this on. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Yeah, just leave them there. Okay, now click on that. Enable the oxygen. Bring in the oxygen. 23. We'll go 23. Happy medium. Put them in. Um, and then just that would work. Yeah, that would work. Let's bring in a few of those. Whatever the heck these are. But they're kind of cool looking. Whoa. Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Put a few of those things in there. There we go. There we go. Now this should be this should be fine, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It should be fine. It's 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 heating up. There we go. There we go. It's better. It's better. It's better. Okay, so that's good. Uh, let's put the fish actually in. Okay. What are the fish gonna want? Temperature's good. Plants they could need a little bit more. Fish amount is perfect where it's at. 
Um, don't add any more fish in here, is what the Emperor Angelfish is telling us. And it's probably due to, because they look like they can become very big over time. So, a couple more plants, and just a few decorations. Very, very simple fish here, I like to say. Actually kind of happy that this fish is less needy. Now, is that all for saltwater fish? Saltwater fish are less needy? Maybe not. By the way, good shout. Um, another one is like when you clicked on the seashells from the last, make sure that you are looking at what actually is good for them and not. The seashells down by the seashore are good for the saltwater fish. Um, you find seashells at the ocean. Saltwater. Right? Obviously. So I should have probably uh, paid attention more to that. I just put them in because I thought they were just cool looking. Really. Kind of sprinkle them around. What do the fish think about that? They said, give me a little bit more on the decoration and you're good to go, partner. Okay. Now for the backdrop. I don't know. For the backdrop. Let's see. Deep blue sea. I like that. Deep blue sea. Um, add a little bit more. Uh, you know, I kind of like to see the seashells. There, I, you know what? This could be a nice, easy, basic type of uh type of type of aquarium and i'm not even upset about it let's do that let's make it basic simple nothing too crazy a few seed weeds here um a few shells there maybe some light action yeah a light action wouldn't be too bad some over here how you looking now bermuda or sorry not bermuda emperor they're looking fine they're looking great they're having a good time okay let's go in and add ourselves a little bit of light action preferably two please thank you very much and then let's put these on the back right there and then come on come on come on come on come on dude come on there you go right there okay nice now i like this like glow here right i'm kind of thinking white or blue let's see what the white or the blue is like first that's all right i was looking at the white yeah the white seems more realistic it's like ah they're in the ocean right the sun coming down from the from the top right i like that cool super super basic super basic now fourteen hundred dollars uh you know you could be you could be the judge on that we can not enable it for the shop which we will do and we will take it and we will put it right over here partner so now we have this going on here with these Xanders, which by the way probably look more into this their fish population is terrible so what you need to probably do is enable to sell the fish so we'll sell the fish and that will be kind of a passive thing now real real quick let's make sure that we are buying fish food yes absolutely and let's feed our fish you idiot let's feed them yeah there you go there's some nice fish food come on over here nice fish food as well there you go good job and then let's put that back. All right, very good. Our shop is going to be opening up here. Can I actually put this on the shelf? Oh, I can. Oh, nice. Very good. And this, put that right there. All right, a little bit more organized, more clean. Um, again, with the jobs, I, I, I don't know if there will be more or different jobs in the future, but this one sucks. <laughs> Not that it sucks. It's just, you know, it, it gets boring after a little bit, right? That's all right. So we'll do a little bit of this. Come on, come on, come on. There we are. There we go. All right. So, I guess the idea from the last episode that I'm trying to say is that we were we were thinking about breeding the fish and selling the fish passively, working on our retail sales, and hopefully that will get us towards the 10k. Now, at least so far that we've seen, it's very, very, very minimal that you get a profit from bringing in an aquarium and selling it off. Now, that might be because of how I'm how I'm going throughout it. It might be because that I'm not taking the conscious um, uh, expense uh, factor here. Like, what I mean, what I guess what I'm trying to say is maybe I'm cost effective. There you go, cost effective. Now let's do let's do a tiny tiny uh, tiny tank. So let's calculate this: one hundred and thirty dollars for the tank. I'm going to continue. Oh, I think this is actually empty. It is empty. Okay, I'm not going to continue doing that. Because uh, that is actually gonzo. That sucks. Right? I think it is. It 
So, okay, yeah, okay. We gotta get new stuff. All right, so let's see here. If we go into um, da, 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 soil, is there like base prices off of everything? Or is everything the same? Is it like base price 55? No, okay, there's different things here. $77, we were running with a $61 one. Uh, this one is 52, probably the cheapest soil that you can get. 35, now that is the cheapest one that you can get. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Now, the only problem here is that if you go cheap on your things, that just means that your aquarium is just going to be worth cheap. So let's go here. We'll go this soil. Good for fresh and good for sea. We'll buy the cheap soil. Where's my shovel? There it is. Okay, we'll grab this. And we'll put this in. Okay. All right. First things first. Now, one thing I'm kind of thinking of here is I'm thinking of making a small tank full of fish goldfish you know what i mean like a place where you can just breed goldfish i don't know i'm just trying to think outside the box here really uh let's go ahead and grab the bucket as well there we go so we spent 130 dollars on the tank 35 dollars on the soil so we're already looking at um 165 right 165 dollars in the hole on this one tank and it is time to open and we can open if we want to which i will open just to get that out of the way there we go awesome hang on a second let me just put this down let's invite them in and if anything they should buy our retail stuff and they should buy our fish right here buy the xanders okay they did not buy any of the xanders that sucks that that that, that ultimately sucks that, that yeah right satisfaction 69 that's the only satisfaction i'm getting there <laughs> um okay all right so let's let's focus in on the xanders a little bit because they're gonna be pissed off they're like hey yeah you're you know you are um we're too crowded over here so 108 dollars for that xander 108 dollars for that xander and we're good on fish population good all right we'll come over here see if these guys had oh see if these guys had any offspring doesn't seem like that's the case nope their fish amount is good okay good we'll just keep an eye all right so now we're breeding so i made uh, 216 dollars off of just these fish breeding themselves i told you it was a grind <laughs> it, it, it's a grind but i don't know i i feel like that was a little bit of progress i was expecting customers to buy but they didn't but that's all right you know I, i'm all right with that do i can i add another little bit of layer i don't think i can i think that's the the most i can add to that uh little little thing here i don't think it is Oh, maybe it is. Okay, that's enough. Okay, again, we are about $165, I believe, if I remember correctly, on this tank. It's already valued at $83. So we're kind of already, like, just half of what we've spent already. Okay, so let's see here. What kind of thing do you want? Let's make this a fresh water again. And we want to make it the cheapest of the cheap. So the goldfish, probably the cheapest fish that you can get of all time, right? There's no way around it. If there's a cheaper fish... Okay, the guppy. All right. <laughs> The guppy is the cheapest. All right, let's not go with the guppy route because I, I, I have a hard time clicking on those sons of guns. Those are just too small. We'll go for the goldfish. We'll buy multiple goldfish. We'll buy five goldfish. Again, I should not do this first. I should do that last. 18 to 25, right? Let's do my research here. 18 to 24. Okay, so first things first. We want to buy ourselves a... Uh, well, we want to buy one lamp. We want to buy one heater. We want to buy one thermometer. And we want to buy one filter, one cheap filter. Now, the thing here is plants. Freshwater plants, 18 to 24. It's not hard to find anything. Like this, this hydrophilia. Uh, let's do it. Actually, hang on a sec. Let's not do it. $19 for that. $22 for that, $27 for that, $17 for that, $28 for that, $30 for that, $41 for that, $42 for that. So the cheapest one would be this one, $18 to $24. We can technically bring that in. So let's bring in let's bring in three. We'll bring in three for now. Make sure we place our our tub here, our lamp on our tub. <laughs> put this right here. Put this right there. I shouldn't put like the, the heater and the stuff in the front because it just makes it look awful right 
It does. It does make it look awful. Okay, there we go. Okay, now we'll start putting our, our grass in there. And again, the whole idea about this fish tank was to go as cheap as we possibly could. So that we can breed the goldfish. And we can make money, more money in the long term, I guess. Let's go three. Three goldfish. Probably going to need more than that. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Hey, you, 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 you actual idiot. Okay, let's turn on the heater. Let's turn on the heater. 23. 23. Let's turn on the oxygen. Let's turn on the oxy oxygen. Item isn't underwater. You, are you kidding me? Turn on the oxygen or they're going to die. There you go. Whew. That was close. That was close. Okay. All right. Um, go inside here. What is their needs? They're actually good on plants. They say, you know what? This is enough plants. They can live in a bunch of fish or they can live to have a bunch of fish. So that's good. The only thing we really need to do is that just a little bit of decoration. That's that. Now, I don't think any of these are going to be other than salt water. That's all salt water decoration. So I'm going to stay out of that. Coral. Is that the same thing? Coral seems salt water too. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to be fabricated for an anchor. No, we want cheap. So that, that's too much. What about rocks? Rocks. $10 rock. $11 rock. $13 rock. $20 rock. $17 rock. $28 rock. $25 rock. Good God. Um, $32 rock. <laughs> Let's just go for a simple $10 rock. $10 rock. Maybe a couple. Three. Three, three $10 rocks. Cheap. Same color almost as the foil. Or sorry, not the foil. The soil. How you guys like that? They say we like it. Well, no. Almost they like it. They say, give us a little bit more than that, their forehead. All right, I got you. What about, you guys like roots? You guys do like roots. $28 root. Let's buy two of those. Two of these shall be good. Oh, watch out, fish. And then put right there. Just simple things. Decoration is good. Fish amount's good. Plants are good. Temperature's good. How's the, how's the plants? Plants are wonderful as well. Okay, good. Now, let's go in and add them a little bit of a backdrop. Now, I'm going to go for the cheap backdrop this time. Yeah, super, super cheap. Uh, $22 compared to like $45, right? Or $42. So let's go for a cheap one. Let's stay with the gray kind of gray black theme going on here. Let's do that. Yeah, and let's put that right here. And this will be a so simple, very, very simple uh, aquarium here. Dare I do yellow. Green. Red. Blue. White. Pink. I like the, I like the, I, 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 I think I like the red. The red. I like the red. Blast it. Okay. Cool. So, overall, the, the tank itself, 568 with the fish added. Now, we bought the tank. This is a, probably about a marginal difference in profit here. But this is going to go in the back. So there we go. The whole point of this is to really breed the goldfish and then sell the goldfish, I guess. Goldfish don't sell for that much. So that's just hopefully going to be a farm at some point. Take a look at these guys over here. You guys are fine. Those guys are a little bit more challenging to take care of. Yeah. Look at them. Okay. So they had offspring. Wonderful. Wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. Let's sell a little bit of them. Yeah, 115. Easy 115 there. Right? Easy 115. Oh my god, dude. Click on the damn fish. 116. Sold. How you like me now? Okay, there we go. Little bit of money there. And then you can kind of mix it in with a little bit of this. Right? So clean off an aquarium. And so, I guess you could keep doing this repeat pattern and kind of breed the fish, right? And then over time, you'll be able to sell some of the fish. And then towards the end of our like quest challenge thing, 10 grand, we can then sell the aquariums to catch ourselves on that 10 grand. You know what I mean? So we can actually, you know, find ourselves $10,000 easily if we sell the aquariums with it to go along with. Right. So we have one more extra spot that we can do, I think, in the back. Right. Two or one. One. One more extra spot that we can work with uh, to breed fish. So let's get that rolling here. I think 
$893, right? $893 is not going to cut it for what I have in store. But luckily, we have the jobs. So I think this next aquarium that I'm about to do is going to be heavily fueled by jobs. Because this is going to be... Now I'm going to try to make the most expensive aquarium. Uh, most expensive aquarium. Well, not the most expensive aquarium. Sorry, let me back that up. Most expensive fish. Not aquarium. Most expensive fish. And now, I think we already have some of the most expensive fish already breeding. Right? Now, the good thing here... Well, at least a thing here. Is that if you were to mix species of fish you could breed more variety at different rates right i get that but let's be honest here how far can my brain go um okay so what what, what we'll do is it's either going to be a salt water or fresh water i'm not really entirely sure here so if i were to sell all of our aquariums right now right now if i were to sell all of our aquariums we're looking at potentially 2,500 plus 1,500, which is 4,000, right? Plus 500. So that's like 45 to $4,600 altogether if we sold everything as is right now. Or we can continue to bring in that grind, right? Bring in that grind. And you know what? $500, if we can get $500 to clean tanks and add these shelves, that's more cabinets that we can have. For retail as well so there's even that kind of kind of thing too as well so this whole cleaning tanks thing is gonna be more valuable to us than I initially thought right off the bat yes it's a boring thing yes it sucks but it's the beginning right it's absolutely the beginning so um, real quick before the day is about to start or before we open up here let's make sure that we are refilling our retail there we go and then just get ready like why is that flashlight on honestly <laughs> can i sell that thing okay okay um first things first easy peasy lemon freaking squeezy you get the uh what the heck do you get you get the well you get that later but you get the heater you get the thermostat and then you go ahead and you say I want a filter and maybe a light maybe not maybe I don't do a light this time maybe I, I I say no to the light right let's put this right here this right here and then put this right here make sure to turn that on actually I don't like the fact that it was right there over here thank you now turn it on okay so what fish are we targeting now do I have salt or was that just a one bag thing that was a one bag thing. So how much is actually salt? $73. Wow. Okay, so what if we went with a freshwater fish here? What is the most expensive freshwater? The discus, the blood parrot's not bad. The Oscar, the angel, the guppy. Yo, whatever the heck this is. Oh, this is the discus. <laughs> the discus is, is pretty expensive. And not too hard to do. I mean, the Xander, obviously. Let's do the disc, the, the discus. So 27 to 30. We're looking for 27 to 30 temperature here. Let's go to fresh water. 27 to 30. That would be correct. Let's get this in. 27 to 30. So that's 42. That would be 22. That would work. 19. 27, that would not work okay okay yeah 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 so it looks like the 19 will hit it good pop that for five okay then we go in i know our people are at the door waiting for us there we go slide those in real quick there we go and there we go okay let's go open up our shop real quick hey oh why is our plants acting weird buy the fish you cowards Hey, they bought goldfish. Oh, no, they didn't. They bought stuff from the damn... Um, yeah, $260. They bought... I forgot to switch this off. Damn it, they bought my lamp, I think. Are you guys okay? Plants. They need a little bit more plant action. 
What is this? A, uh, a Valens... What the heck was that? A Valen what? Oh, this thing. Two of those. Damn it. They bought that. There we go. And there we go. Wonderful. I mean, they had... I feel like this is, this is bad over here. I need to add this. Yeah, I just killed my plants, didn't I? Uh... Shoot, 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 shoot. I did, I did, I did. I did. 24, 27, dude. 27. Will they come back to life? Will they come back to life? Oh, they do. Oh, thank God. <laughs> okay. Back to over here. Let's give them a light. One. One. I wish you... I wish I... Like, I wonder how much money... Do I make money off of selling these things? You know? I think I wanted red. Do I make money off of these these things? Like when I sell them the single thing, like the single lamp, right? Do I make money? I don't know. I really don't know. But we can have these goldfish breed like little monsters. Looks like we have a little bit of an algae problem over here. Uh, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this to the side real quick. Yep. And we're gonna bring this to the workbench. And we're gonna start working on this bad boy. Make sure these guys are good. And then obviously we need to feed our fish as well. Let's not forget about feeding time. Feeding time in the zoo. Oh my god. The worst place to put a castle because I can't see what the heck is going on in the front here. Why can't I just go from the front and clean from the front? There we go. There we go. Da, 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 da. Now that's a good backdrop. That will help <laughs> me clean this out. I love the jellyfish. Looks good. <clears throat> it looks real good. We'll go here. This is like breeding monsters, man. We're breeding little monsters. Okay, give me the give me the food. Feed them up. 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 There you go. Come over here. Feed these guys up too. I like how the simple life they live. They live the simple life there, starring Paris Hilton. Okay, and then we'll do this. Okay, we'll put you back now. You guys go back. I don't know if you guys have a population problem. I'll come back to that shortly. But I'm really focused more on this one now. All right, let's see here. Um, turn that off immediately because I don't even want to get lost in the sauce there. So we were on the discus, yeah? Yeah, we were on the discus. I think that's how you pronounce it. The discus. It's by four of them. I don't know how many we need. Okay. What do you guys want? I'll give you anything you want. Fish amount is good. Plants are good. A little bit of decoration would be nice, they say. I say fair. Let's do it. Can I give you, like, some cheap-ass rocks? Maybe a few of them? Simple as, all, as well? Drop on your head. Watch out. Coming through. How you like me now? Decoration could be better. Okay. Give you a few more rocks. Of the same kind, too. Not even a different variation. It's getting very vanilla in there. Watch out. Coming through. <laughs> All right. Now, let's add a backdrop. What kind of backdrop would you guys like? Would you guys like a... No, you guys want an orangish because it kind of fits your guys' color. Orangish, red, reddish type backdrop there, yeah? Sure. And do you guys deserve a light? I honestly don't even know what you guys deserve. Temperature is okay, I guess. I guess we can go up one on the temperature just to play it safe. 28. Let's go 28. They might like that. Decoration is good. Plants are good. Fish amount will eventually be good because they'll, they'll figure themselves out. Okay. Let's put them off over here. Wonderful. There we go. So now we're breeding uh, discus now in the back room here. I didn't put a light in because I'm, I'm kind of unsure on that. So let's come back over here to the Xanders. See how the Xanders are doing? Anybody dead? Nope. Nobody dead. Nobody dead. And it's a good day. Fish amounts doing fine. Uh oh. Wait a sec. What's going on here? Hunger. Okay. You are actually hungry. Would you like more food? Okay. I didn't realize you guys need a lot of food. Hang on a sec. Let's give you some more hunger. There you go. How's that look? Okay, hunger? Yeah, you could use a little bit more. All right. You guys are, like, needy little guys, aren't you? You guys eat a lot. Yeah, grow up, be strong, and procreate. That's what I would like. What about you guys? I'm assuming you guys probably need a little bit more, right? 
Yeah, there you go. Okay, they have a little bit of a fish population problem that we can get s sorted out. We can sell, definitely for sure. How are you guys doing over here? You guys hungry still? No, you guys are good. You're, gold you're goldfish. You should be, like, eating, like, once a week. How about you, Discus? You guys good? Yeah, you guys are good. You guys are good, hunger-wise. Okay, very good. Put them back. Oh, sorry. There we go. Cool. All right, so let's go ahead and sell ourselves a... What the heck is this again? I don't even know the name. The Emperor Angelfish. Let's, set, let's sell, of them. sell one of them. Right. Um, now... Do I sell the oldest and then keep the newest coming? Or do I keep the oldest and sell the newest? You know what I mean? I don't want to click on the seaweed. $96. Sell that. I'm going to hold on to the oldest. I'm going to see what happens, right? I'm assuming we want the oldest so that they could grow to be big and like we sell them at a higher premium. I don't know. I don't know. You would think that kind of works. That logic kind of works backwards in the in like the dog world and the cat world. You want the kitten or you want the puppy. At a premium and like the old dogs get sold off for like nails and buckets right they don't get sold off for anything all right so again another thing that we can do is we can work on our retail end of the game here uh which is kind of buy 500 dollars supplies for customers right um it's basically doing just two jobs like or not two jobs doing five jobs to get us those shelves and i think over time i guess it will be good I don't know maybe what i'll do is i'll do this kind of like off camera type thing where it's like i clean and i bring in a bunch of bring in a bunch of retail space here because maybe that's what the game wants maybe the game wants me to, to to get all the retail space looked out after you know what i mean sure dude i know what you mean you've only like explained it 27 times right yeah you're right <laughs> all right okay are we are we gonna open soon we're not gonna be opening soon so if i do that that's good do that let me hang on a sec let me just turn on my fan i am sweating it is hot oh god it's on high speed yeah, let's not put it on full blast okay add another one thank you we'll do that da -da. i could be going about this like the complete wrong way i don't know i could be like doing this totally wrong i really don't know i, I don't know if you if any of you guys have like put a lot of hours into this game please let me know comment down below tell me some of the strats and tactics that you use and i i think i'll probably use the same ones that'd be fun yeah because again when it comes to the, like the aquarius type thing or the uh the aquarium or being a fish salesman i'm not the person to go to to, to buy a fish from all right i'm the last person to go to to buy a fish from there we go okay so hang on a sec let's let's go ahead and buy this over here right there we go now we just need wait not enough money for what not enough money to, to get that going on okay that's all right forgot we need to supply it too yeah so if you're playing this at home and you're like oh yeah let me know is it a grind is it a grind like i'm expecting it to be or is it like kind of or am i missing out am i missing out on a key part of the game where it's like you could be doing you could be making way more money if you did this and this could be resell your aquariums all the time or this could be um, make sure that you have multiple fish in your aquarium so that you can have multiple species so that it is um, somewhere where you can sell like sw sell the aquarium for even higher or you can breed right is breeding the way to go I don't know yeah that's good can we refill this yeah yeah okay there we go we have another shelf up hooray now I got to do five more shelves like this five more shelves to clean or sorry, yeah, five more aquariums. Tanks. Sorry, tanks are called tanks. They're not called aquariums. Well, I guess they are called aquariums in some degree. You know what I mean. Five more tanks to, to clean, and I can buy another shelf. And then there's like four shelves that I'm missing here. So I know I could do this a lot easier if I just sell one of my tanks right now. And then I can buy the, uh, the retail stuff also. But, you know, might not be a bad idea because then I could go and... Uh, I can go and then... Uh, replace those aquariums with just new <laughs> new aquariums new ideas new designs i don't know there we go all right what else do we have here i honestly thought there was going to be more to the job list i think this is like this whole job thing is something just to make sure that you don't run out of money uh gameplay mechanic i get it i understand it it's all good it's all good it's all good there we go. There we go. Come on, baby. 
get that green marker off the, off the tank. Is it green marker or is it algae, right? I think it's green marker, yeah? Cool. Send it. Let's see, let's check on the goldfish. How you doing, goldfish? Yeah, dude, these things, these guys are, are they're, they are getting it on, man. They are spawning. You guys are doing good. Let's come on over here. Check these guys. How you guys doing? They're spawning too. These guys are spawning pretty fast. The, the, the Xanders, they don't spawn that often, no, do they? How you guys doing? They don't spawn that often. You guys all could use a little bit more food, kind of, I guess. We'll give these guys some food because I know they're kind of lacking. They, they're, 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 they're spawning more than they're eating. They're living the best life over there. <laughs> there we go. And who knows? Maybe I just sell that cheap aquarium, that one I made with the with the uh, with these guys, the discus. Maybe you know, fourteen hundred dollars extra in my pocket. Would I make a profit from that? Uh, 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 that tank again I think it's very very marginal I think it's barely anything if anything at all now however one thing that I could do with the discus though is I could add other types of fish within the temperature here falls under a not so uh, it falls under like 28 degrees 28 degrees for a fish water is not bad for fish water fish 28 degrees that's like most of the fish yeah kind of like most of the fish so if i were to bring in an angel fish angel fish would be like hell yeah brother let's get it going right 105 dollars for an angel fish three of them let's see let's try it out let's add these multiple species in now okay so instant thought that they have is fish amount uh they wish they had a little bit more maybe and maybe the discus oh my god that's a fat son of a gun there Discus is fine. Discus is like, yeah, you know what? We're doing all right. We're living our life. Uh, angelfish could use a little bit more. Maybe a little bit more angelfish. Now, I guess one thing that I'm kind of confusing myself with is that when it says, like, it, not angelfish, when it says um, fish amount, is it fish amount that they like in the tank of their own species? Or is it a, an accumulation? Like, all of the fish inside the tank. Because if it's a by if a, if it's a species by species thing, that's a little bit easier to kind of delegate, right? It's going to open up our aquarium, sell our retail. You guys are more than welcome to buy a freaking fish. All right, you guys are wanting just to buy retail. Understood. Why is everybody that come into my <laughs> why why is everybody that comes into my aquarium or my like dungeon down here is like somewhat attractive everybody's attractive here <laughs> that comes in it's like the prettiest people in the world come to come to my basement to, to buy fish stuff <laughs> it's weird man these guys really pollute a lot now don't don't they these guys are all over the i feel like i have to clean their cage or clean their tank like once a day every single day i have to like clean their tank it's kind of getting ridiculous a good man you guys need to get it together Use the toilet. What are you doing? You, you, you can't tell me the toilet's not in the castle. There should be a toilet inside the castle. Go in there. Check it out. See. Plumbing's not installed? All right. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I just talk, I, I'm just talking with the fish. I am. I'm just talking with the fish. Probably should feed them, too. There we go. Wonderful. 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 Wunderbar. Let's see here. Oh, they're actually pretty good. Uh, food wise now it looks like they did procreate because our value did go up yeah our value did go up unless their value went up because of the size of the fish like bigger fish bigger everything how you guys doing over here yeah you guys are getting a little busy yeah a little busy indeed okay right on how's the goldfish dude these guys are out of control look at them <laughs> oh my god they're just all over the place. They're just hump, hump, uh, hump. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't think fish do that. But hey, $2,000, $2,000. I could probably sell one of these fishes, huh? these, one of these discus. Let's sell the expensive one. 
There we go. How you guys doing? And now you're doing better. How about the angelfish? Okay, good. It is by species. It looks like to be at least by species. Maybe. Let's see. I'm trying to find that meter. See if it lays in the same area. Maybe. I'm not I'm not 100% sure here. Like selling those for 20 bucks a pop. <laughs> that sounds expensive. $20 a goldfish still sounds kind of expensive. Okay, the emperor angelfish here. These guys are like, uh, we're, we're hating life. We're hating life because uh, too many. Too many of us in here. Okay, let's sell you. And then let's sell you. Good. I mean, it's money. Money coming, dude. Money coming for sure. Okay, yeah. So that gives us the ability to buy another shelf. And restock that shelf, too. <laughs> nice. Okay. $16 is, yeah, all we have. Potential $2,600 is what we have over here with the Xanders. Uh, potentially $1,500. So that would be roughly... What is that? Uh, 16... Uh, what is that? Oh, sorry. Not 16. 26. Um, 15. Yeah, so that's about $4,100 there. Plus 800 almost 900 you're looking at potentially five thousand, seven thousand dollars if we sold that one. Okay, yeah, you can see it. it's definitely coming through. So there's like seven thousand dollars within all the aquariums that we have now. But if we were to keep selling and retelling, I think things will get better. Hmm. Interesting indeed. Interesting indeed. Yeah, I think we're on the right track though. But this is the grind for sure. This is absolutely great. Anyways, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Aquarius. I will see you guys in the next one, wherever that may be. And do as always, take care.